This is Gene Key, SkyServe News. The Associated Press reports a plane that crashed in a Colorado snowstorm, killing two people, was a twin-engine Cessna 414A registered in Texas. The plane crashed Sunday afternoon in Yampa Valley Regional Airport in Hayden. Four people were injured. No names have been released. Airport manager Dave Rupel tells the Steamboat Springs pilot and Today newspaper the plane was approaching the airport in a major snowstorm with zero visibility when it crashed. The Yampa Airport is about 25 miles west of the ski resort town of Steamboat Springs. The four injured people were taken to a hospital in Steamboat Springs. There is currently no information being released about their injuries and conditions. WFAA.com reports the pain at the pump is about to get a whole lot worse. Analysis predict a gallon of regular will go for a record $4.25 nationwide by the end of April. WFAA found at least one gas station in Dallas, Uptown District, where motorists are already paying $4.19 for regular, with premium going for $4.39. Nationwide gas now averages $3.55 a gallon, up 17 cents in the last month, and the highest it has ever been at this point in the year. Dallas drivers are currently paying $3.49 on average. Fort Worth motorists paying a penny less. According to AAA Texas, Amarillo has had the cheapest gas in the state of Texas for two weeks out of this month. The Associated Press reports Corpus Christi City Council We'll discuss a proposed ban on plastic retail shopping bags this week. The coastal city is just the latest in a series of Texas cities to consider such a ban. The council members will today take up the idea for the first time for discussion. No vote is scheduled. The Corpus Christi Caller Times reports discussions of such a ban had remained at the city committee for the past two years, but drew fuel recently after the Coastal Bend Surfrider Foundation joined a national Skip the Plastic initiative. Brownsville became the first Texas city to adopt a plastic bag ban last year. Fort Stockton, South Padre Island, and Pecos followed. Austin, San Antonio, and McAllen are also considering bans. If you would like the latest Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow on YouTube. Simply search SkyServe News or Gene Key. You can also follow me on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, SkyServe News.